come on. It has been way too long since I've done one of these, right? Alright, let's get into this. I am very, very excited about this. I have to tell you, you know, drop and dime on all of these to do the unboxing. I could complain about that, but I wouldn't be very honest to myself if I did because I really enjoy this. This is a lot of fun for me. Okay, there it is. 1993 calendar of Dragonlands and Other Worlds. All shrink wrapped and beautiful. Now this, I believe, is used. Previously owned or however you want to put it. But it has a, looks like a cardboard backing. Which uh, is a, a way of protecting that I really do appreciate sellers doing. So if you're a seller and you wanna make people trust what you're doing and you know appreciate the products that you're, you're selling, consider maybe a little less shrink wrap. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> My goodness. Um, definitely consider using cardboard backing. To protect these items because you know those of us who are buying them maybe you know we're opening them for stuff like this but we still want them to look nice and be as um, clean as possible right I can't get it off my hand <laughs> it was stuck all right so you can see that there's damage oh, let me show you there's damage on the back as if there was like a something was stuck to it and he had to peel it away. It's not from this cardboard backing, uh, but like I said, this was used. It was very inexpensive. Uh, and you can see a little bit of damage wear and tear, but I get these for the paintings. That's why I get them. So let's, let's dive into this together, shall we? See if we can do this some service. Oh gosh, these are so great looking. I love these paintings. Okay. This is the Scroll of All Knowing from Naewon. I'm not sure what world that's from. I'm sure I could find out. And then you can see the calendar format itself is very different than previous calendars, as expected. Gotta love this one. That's Tennis and Kittyara. Had a bit of a fling back in the day. <laughs> this is from Steel and Stone, The Meeting Sextet, Volume 5. And this is a cool image. This is definitely a remnant of um, Braum. And, of course, you see his name right there. And this is Dark Dawn from Dragon Kings. Braum has a very distinct style. This is actually a Forgotten Realms painting. Alyssa of the Mists. I am not familiar with Forgotten Realms as much as I am Dragonlance. They're, it's all right. You know, I'm a fan. It's good stuff. Flint's Axe. That's great. Not sure what that creature is, though I did read the book back in the day. Untitled number two from Night Parade. Cool little fantasy. Once they started running out of Dragonlance paintings, they just started throwing in End Other Worlds. <laughs> Which I'm okay with. Oh, look at that. Look at that. This is Siege of Lord Iyer's Crag from Dragon Magazine. That's great. So I don't mind the Other Worlds addition to these. Knight's Sword. That's a really great painting. I like that a lot. Great colors. Tonal variations there. Shape Shift of the Shaman. 
son of Aska. I'm not sure what world that's from, but that's good. <laughs> Gammonites. This is Quadfire. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I love all the creatures. I'm a big fan of all the little different creatures. Knight of the Walking Dead. Oh, yeah. Look at the gory in the faces of these zombies. I love that stuff. It's from Big Horror Nut. Oh, yeah. Oath in the Measure. Love this one. Meeting Sextet Volume 4. Have you guys read these? I don't remember the details. I remember reading them as a kid. I'm going to have to revisit them someday. Oh, yes! <laughs> Lord Soth. This is the Cataclysm. Tales 2 Trilogy, Volume 2. Ah, oh, love me some Lord Soth. He's so awesome. And that is it for this 1993 Dragonlance and Other Worlds calendar. What do you guys think? Do you have a favorite painting from one of these? Do you have a favorite year collection? Let me know. Have a fantastic day. Until next time, Slangevar.